Hi! Welcome to my magical science lab. Today, we are going to cast a spell on a tomato. Uh, but we don't do spells. We do experiments. Tomato experiments. Experimatus. Together, we're going to learn what the Archimedes principle is today. Archimedes, the famous magician. Almost mm. as famous as me. Ooh, here's what we need. One glass. Water. One tomato. Cooking salt. One teaspoon. What happens if I put a tomato in a glass of water? Choose the correct outcome. <laughs> put the correct ingredients in the glass to perform the experiment. What will happen to the tomato after mixing water and salt? Choose the correct outcome. Uh. <laughs> Mix the water and salt to see what will happen. When you immerse an object in liquid, the water tries to push it up, but it doesn't always succeed. It can't do it with a hammer because the hammer is heavier than water. With a balloon, on the other hand, it can, because it is light and full of air. In the beginning, for example, the tomato sank because it was heavier than water. But when the salt dissolved in the water, it worked its magic. It made the water thicker and stronger, so much so that it was able to push the tomato upwards. Guess who discovered this principle? Obviously, the famous scientist Archimedes. That's why it's called the Archimedes Principle. It looks like magic, but it's actually science. Eureka! 